Becoming comfortable navigating Drake Accounting is key to making your day-to-day -day accounting tasks more efficient. Let's take a look at some of the navigation features. When we first open Drake Accounting, we see the Client Selector screen. Click a client to make that client the active client. The active client is highlighted in blue. We also show the active client at the top and bottom of the Client Selector grid and at the top of the Drake Accounting title bar. The data grid is an alternating row highlights to help you easily distinguish between clients. A client with missing setup information is highlighted in dark gray. By selecting this client, a message will show that there is missing required fields. You'll also notice the calendar year or fiscal year is displayed at the top of the client selector window. You can sort your clients by clicking on the client code, client name, ID number, and business type or enter client code into the client code box. Click the backup icon to backup the current client to the backup path specified on the firm information setup screen. Add a new client by clicking the icon in the middle or by going to client add. This is the rebuild client list icon. Only if the client list is out of sync will you be able to select this button. This may occur when you add or delete clients. We display the last time the active client was backed up on the bottom of the client selector window. We also show the version of Drake Accounting you are using, where the program is installed, and the version of Windows being used. It's important to be aware of the location of this information should you ever need to contact our Drake Accounting support team with any type of issue. We've made navigating between the various modules very easy using the tree view on the left side of the window. This tree view is continuously displayed throughout the program, so you can jump, say from setting up an employee to edit the client or to the accounting module. You can toggle between showing and hiding the tree view by either clicking the hamburger button or pressing Control Shift T. Some of these menu items can be expanded even further. It's not necessary to close a screen before going to another module. Click the desired module, such as payables, then Vendor Setup in the tree view, and Drake Accounting will then close the current window and open a new screen. If there are unsaved entries on the screen when you close it, you'll receive a prompt to save. If you click No, any changes made on the screen will not be saved. For more information, go to accounting.drakesoftware.com.